lado. But enough messing around. Don't have a lot of time to fish today. It's already 6 p.m. right now. I made it. Where I'm gonna start. Well. I have made it to the pond I'm gonna be fishing today and I do kind of have a special video today I brought one lure with me and that's all actually a few months ago one of my subscribers requested that I buy a boogerman buzzbait so that is exactly what I did and that is the only lure I brought with me today so that's what I'm gonna be using this is a look at the package I got it in cotton candy pink color Let's take it out of the package and uh, tie it on. So full disclosure, I have already tried making a video using this bait and I just didn't catch any fish. But that being said, I definitely wanted to give this bait a fair shake. Me using it just one time for about an hour and a half really isn't getting a good sense of what the bait does and how it works. Quickly tie this on. Got two trailers with me. I brought this Speed Shad from Bass Pro. And then I also bought this Kamikaze, or brought this Kamikaze Swim On. I think what I'm gonna start out with is the Speed Shad. And this buzz bait does come with a bait keeper as well, as you guys can see right there. It also comes with a rubber band, not hand tied or anything like that, which is good. I guess if you want to change the skirt out like so there is that buzz bait ready to catch some big largemouth it's a hot one this evening as well 90 degrees but i kind of had to put on a sweatshirt because the bugs out here get so thick i kind of have to wear a hood oh I just need to figure out a way to uh, get out a little bit further here. Got one first cast. Oh my gosh, that is a giant largemouth first cast with a gigantic craw. Oh my gosh, he has a gigantic craw down in there. That's a solid two pounder. I didn't even know there was crawfish in here, let alone lobsters in here. Oh my gosh, first cast? I ain't gonna lie, my bait wasn't even working half the time right there. Ooh, missed him. Ah. Ripped that tail off.
That feels big. It's not. Pickerel, though. Really? Right, being able to reel this a little bit slower than I have been previously, I definitely think is going to help me get bit a little bit more. What I did was just bend this shaft part right here down towards the head of the bait like that. And that's helping me um, stay at the top of the water. Maybe I should. <laughs> almost just stuff fell off this log here well that bass definitely wanted it pale bass uh, you see where that point comes out that's where I'm headed to next so cool it was a fish literally just chilling down there it actually looked catchable not big but catchable oh this is so cool oh my gosh look at that break go right up here can see it up there where it flares out. Oh my gosh, he hammered it, dude. Oh, wow. <laughs> that fish hammered it. I'll take that. Another two pounder right there. Let's see if I can sneak over here. Oh, 
Oh yes, I can. Thought you were a little bit bigger than that. Consider that one my bad. Hope you guys can kind of see that. Very blue. There's the kicker. There's the kicker. Maybe not. Not even gonna lie, this bass uh, hit it without even me moving it. Man, fish in here look nice today. Oh my gosh, that's another nice bass. Look at him jump. It's another nice bass. Chill, chill, chill. Oh my gosh, what another nice bass. Yeah, okay, I have two spots left. Both are only gonna take maybe five minutes to fish. Oh yeah, that's the kicker. That's the kicker. Oh, that's a nice fish. Oh, look at him jump. Get up here. Yes, baby. That's what I'm talking about. He inhaled it. Look at... I don't know if he could have gotten it much deeper than that. Yeah, you can go, bud. Slipped out of my hands right there. All right, so that is it for today's video. And overall, definitely had a pretty good day on this Boogerman buzz bait. And just to go over my bait again, this bait was a quarter of an ounce buzz bait. The color was cotton candy pink. And as a trailer, all I was using was a Bass Pro Speed Shad. And because I have zero intentions, of changing out the skirt i kind of wish they hand tied the skirt to the trailer but if you do like changing out your skirts then i guess that rubber band is a good thing and i had that to 65 pound braid on a heavy bass x rod come out with videos every single week thank you guys so much for watching i really do appreciate it peace